continued warming since the 2016 El Nino um, could lead to 2024 um, being one for the record books. But that is, of course, no means a guarantee because weather and the randomness of our atmosphere still plays a part. But um, most of the, the warmest years on record that we've seen in the past have happened due to the influence of El Nino because it gives that little bit extra push onto um, the global temperatures on top of the warming that we're already causing due to human-caused climate change. El Nino is not like a storm. El Nino is not going to hit you on Tuesday. El Nino is all about changing the kind of patterns that weather plays in. The interesting thing with El Nino and La Nina is that it doesn't necessarily create more extreme weather that happens in a given year. Uh, the difference bet between El Nino and La Nina is that we might have a better idea of where that extreme weather is going to happen. 